Well, the road construction season in Michigan this year is expected to be the heaviest in recent years. Oh, come on. It's, know, how can it possibly get more? <laughs> in some places, the season has already started. Local Board Business Editor Rod Maloney tells us tonight some local businesses in a well-known shopping district are not too happy at all about it. Well, it was quite the confusing surprise out here on Old North Woodward as local businesses open up this morning to all of this and more than that, a complete lack of parking. The Michigan Department of Transportation designed this traffic flow using parking spaces as a lane, among other unusual features. A one-way street sign was supposed to be covered. The Birmingham Public Works Department said it will be soon. Parking lot number six is open, but also full. Now, the Michigan Department of Environmental Quality forced this work, requiring 200 feet of 24-inch sewer drain get replaced as a way to prevent sanitary sewage overflow. The city did put out this flyer last week, warning of the project, but Serena Shamoot of the Little Rascal said she didn't get one. Have you had any customers today? No, I've had customers call and say we can't get in. Uh, it's really frustrating. We didn't get an email. We didn't get a notice. Nothing from the county, nothing from the district. Lori Carball wasn't prepared for what she found today. We don't have enough parking as is, let alone have no parking for the next few weeks. Most alarming to them both is that just south of them at Hamilton, there is a construction project and free valet parking provided, they say, by the business district. They got them valet parking, but apparently we don't rate. Local 4 made repeated calls to the city and the business district, and none of them were returned to get answers on that subject. The city public works department told us they're doing everything they can to make the project work more smoothly for the neighborhood. So this is only temporary. It's going to last two weeks, they say perhaps three. But as soon as it's finished here, they're going to pack all of this up and move it just up the street for yet another construction program. In Birmingham, Rod Maloney, Local 4. Well, you got to make improvements, but it's so hard on these local businesses. Small businesses, yep. Sometimes they can't survive something yeah, like this. Yeah, really hard on them. Yep.